Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. I know Pimp as Chad Butler. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now, this is the thing that Pimp did that he didn't do around a lot of people. When we were, when I was on a tour with him, we would, you know, do our music and get off the stage and do, he would always call me and say, and, and I would mark him. He would always, she said that. Mm -hmm. She would always, he would always come in. Hey, Ronnie, what you doing? I said, man, I'm just telling you, man, come on down here. Let's go to the Waffle House. I need to eat some steak and eggs. <laughs> I said, okay, all right. steak and eggs? He said, yeah, we're going to get steak and eggs. I don't want nobody else with us. just going to be me and you. <laughs> so he still got his pimp feel yeah. talking to me. And I would laugh because I'm like, this, he's a character, but he's a really good So that dude. was him all the time. He no. never turned it on and off? He turned on and off. Oh, so okay. it's like when he get ready to go to the show, well, I'll put it this way. When we together, he's like real calm and just say, hey, man, come on, man, let's go. Go chill. Okay. Go to the mall or something. Buy some stuff and, you know, for the next show. So be cool. The character ain't out yet. But as soon as we get out the car, the character kick in. <laughs> so we getting ready to go to the mall. We don't realize how early it is. It ain't open. So the security come to the door. And this is the first time he's, he talked. So he say, I wonder why why y'all don't open the door for me. I'm Pimp C. Y'all don't open this damn door. I'm trying to spend some money. You know what I'm saying? So, so I'm looking at him saying he didn't change. You know what I'm saying? He didn't change his character. He say, you know who I am? I'm Pimp C. Open the door. I got money. You know what I'm so, so dude said, man, we ain't open. He said, man, I don't give a damn about you. Open, open the door. Open it. So I'm like, man. So I'm just sitting back. He said, what you waiting on? Come on in. So I said, all right, see, come on in. I come on in and... He kind of, he said, we just going to win the shot. And so he got his hands and he do his mouth like that. We just going to win the shot. I'm looking for, I'm looking for some shit tonight. Because I'm performing. I'm like, man. So he said, Ronnie, what you want? I said, man, whatever we, I mean, whatever you need me to be in. He said, get what you want. Because I'm paying for it. I got money. So I'm like, man, so the security, okay, yes, sir. Oh, yes, sir. We're going, I'm going to go get my manager. So we open the door. Go get him. So I said, man, <laughs> I'm looking at this cat. I'm like, man. What city really, we all in? He really, we was in Chicago. <laughs> so I'm, I'm chilling. I'm like, man, he really in myself. I'm saying to myself, he really is then turning to the character again. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so you know what I'm saying? So after we got all our stuff and then we get back in the car, he said, all right, man, we go eat. <laughs> I said, we're going to eat. He said, yeah, whatever you want, we go eat. I said, all right. So I look at him, I say, well, why you ain't that character no more? He said, this is the thing. I don't, my name is Pimp C. That's my, my stage name and that's who I am. So I have to have the pimpish talk when I'm out because that's what they know me by. Yeah. He said, man, when I get home and get with somebody real that ain't on the, the bullshit, he said, then I turn into Chad, Chad Butler. Butler. And he will only turn, turn into Chad Butler, as far as I'm concerned, is with me because I didn't, I don't smoke, I don't drink. So yeah. he knew I was always focused. Yeah. So he like, and you cool, you laid back. And it's funny, uh, Mama West's mother, she had a Cocker Spaniel. Okay. And the Cocker Spaniel will only come to me. Mm. Really? Everybody else, that, that dog's gonna bite if mm. it, it don't know him. So she will, I'm the only one that she would let Hold a cock of Spaniel. And wow. she kept him clean and she, he, that dog got groomed more than some dudes kept a bath. So <laughs> I'm like, man, and she had him at every show. Mm. And wow. she, she called me, she called me, said, Ronnie, come down there. I need you to walk, watch my dog for a minute. I got to go to the store. So, okay, cool. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101.